Clemson and North Carolina State, both teams 2-0 coming in. Dave Doran has never lost a home game as a head coach. Early on, NC State's front seven dominated Clemson's O-line. Taj Boy pressured, goes down Art Norman the sack. Clemson settles for a field goal, 3-0 Tigers. In the second quarter, leading 6-0. But Shadrach Thornton, his only carry of the night, he's been losing time to Tony Creasy and the freshman Matt Days. That's a great run. 21 yards for the score, 7-6, NC State on top. But Taj Boyd, he answers. That's a great throw to Sam Cooper. Taj converted a fourth down of his own with a run on that drive. The touchdown makes it 13-7, Tigers, early third quarter. Clemson only has 10 men out on the field for the punt. Dabo Sweeney has to call a timeout, and he is furious. Brian Underwood comes around and heads down the sideline. He's gone. 83 yards for the touchdown, or should I say apparent touchdown. The refs call him out of bounds. I don't see it. But NC State forced to start first and 10 at the 47. Three plays later, Pete Thomas fumbles. Spencer Shuey recovers for the Tigers. They dodge a bullet when it looked like NC State had a sure touchdown. And Taj Boyd to a wide open Martavis Bryant. 30 yard touchdown. This is the guy Taj needs. Nuke is in the NFL. Sharon Peak is out with a torn ACL. He needs Martavis Bryant, and that is just an awesome catch. Bryant hauls it in. 26 7, two point attempt failed. Clemson builds the comfortable lead late in the game, an ugly moment. Clemson's Isaiah Battle, really a poor choice. The uppercut on Jarvis Bird knocks him down, and Dabo Sweeney storms out onto the field. He is furious. Battle was ejected. He will not play next week as well against Wake Forest. Clemson goes on to win 26-14. Boyd with three touchdown passes. He is now tied with Chris Winkie for second place on the ACC all-time touchdown list with 79. Phillip Rivers number one with 95 touchdown passes. Clemson at home against Wake Forest. NC State gets Central Michigan.